Hi, I'm Allison Johnson, Principal of Business Development for the AWS Marketplace Channel Team. I'm here to show you, a consulting partner or reseller, how to use AWS Marketplace to resell software with your cloud services and expertise to AWS customers. Let's start by quickly going over what AWS Marketplace is and what it can do for you. AWS Marketplace is a managed and curated software catalog that helps customers innovate faster and reduce costs by making it easy to find, test, buy, and immediately deploy and manage third-party software. AWS Marketplace helps customers move, modernize, manage, and scale the software applications they need for their business now and in the future. They can get to the right software in minutes with just a few clicks, only pay for what they use through various payment options, and all charges from AWS Marketplace are consolidated into your AWS billing. Customers often utilize seller private offers, a feature that enables software vendors on AWS Marketplace to extend customized software pricing and unique commercial terms to their AWS customers. Today, AWS Marketplace has over 230,000 active customers with more than 4,800 software listings from 1,400 software vendors and continues to grow. AWS Marketplace also makes it easy for you as a consulting partner to resell third-party software along with your margin and services through the Consulting Partner Private Offer feature. For clarification, I'll be referencing the Consulting Partner Private Offer feature as CPPO throughout this video. It is important to note that based on feedback from consulting partners and software vendors, we are continuously iterating and automating the CPPO process described in this video. CPPO is a feature in AWS Marketplace that enables you to create custom contracts and resell software. With CPPO, you can include your services and support along with the software vendor's products in one custom private offer. The offer is visible only to the purchasing customer with customized pricing and unique commercial terms. AWS Marketplace simplifies the software provisioning process by invoicing the customer, collecting payment from the buyer, and dispersing the proceeds to you and your software vendor simultaneously. There is no purchase order required as the customer simply clicks a link to access the custom offer. There are many reasons consulting partners are advising their customers to purchase software from AWS Marketplace. Purchases in AWS Marketplace help AWS customers retire existing AWS Enterprise Discount Program commitments. Opportunity closure is accelerated with the ability to customize the terms of the private offer, removal of the purchase order process, and one-click subscription. AWS has dedicated resources to help you with go-to-market and demand generation activities. You can also discover and develop reseller relationships with new cloud-native software vendors in AWS Marketplace. Over the next two minutes, I will show you the process of creating and sending a private offer to your customer. First, you must be a seller of record in AWS Marketplace so that a software vendor can authorize you to resell their listing in AWS Marketplace. To become a seller of record, you agree to the AWS Marketplace terms, which are the same terms software vendors sign when they list their products in AWS Marketplace. Once you've completed this step, you are officially a member of the CPPO Partner Program. Next, a software vendor authorizes you to resell one or more of their products at a discount off the public list price. In this step, a software vendor must complete and sign the AWS Marketplace Reseller Authorization Form. Authorizations can happen on a one-time, non-recurring basis for a high-value negotiated opportunity, or can be a recurring discount that you extend to your child customers to support multiple transactions. Once you're a seller of record in AWS Marketplace and authorized by a software vendor to resell their products, you can start extending custom offers to your AWS customers by authorizing AWS to create them on your behalf. This is done through the completion of our transaction request form. The TRF captures all of the relevant details of the opportunity, including final customer price, start and end dates, and billing details. Once the TRF is received, our customer desk will create the custom offer for your customer in 24 hours or less. 
After the offer has been created, your customer will receive a unique web link that's visible only to them. This web link includes special pricing and custom terms for a product listed in AWS Marketplace. After your customer subscribes by clicking the custom link, AWS Marketplace invoices your customer on their existing AWS bill per the terms outlined in your custom offer. If the offer is extended to a linked account, the invoiced amount appears on the payer account associated with that linked account. Your customer then pays their AWS bill in accordance with the net payment terms that they have agreed to with AWS. AWS collects payment from the customer and disperses it to you and the software vendor simultaneously. Again, AWS does not require a purchase order and there's no invoicing between the partners or AWS. Subscription details and charges are automized and available to you and the software vendor through online on-demand reporting in the AWS Marketplace Management Portal. With AWS Marketplace, the customer subscribes and you get paid. It's that simple. Hopefully, you now have an idea of how AWS Marketplace CPPO works and why more software vendors and consulting partners are opting into this feature to create customizable offers for their AWS customers. Thank you for joining us. I'm Allison Johnson. To get started, visit our webpage shown below.